Hey everyone, this is Carrie Anderson. Hope you all doing well. In today's video, I'll talk about blood glucose meter, how to choose. So if you like the video related to my hair, my way, I would like to request you all please to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon, and give thumbs up, so that I will come up with more and more videos with lots and lots of information. So here we begin this go. If you have diabetes, you will likely need a blood glucose meter to measure and display the amount of sugar glucose in your blood. Exercise, food, medication, stress, and other factors affect your blood glucose level using a blood glucose meter can help you better manage your diabetes by tracking any fluctuation in your blood glucose level. Many types of blood glucose meters are available from basic models to more advanced meters with multiple features and options. The cost of blood glucose meter and test strips varies as does insurance coverage. Study your options before deciding which model to buy. Choose the right meter. When selecting a blood glucose meter, it can help to know the basic of how they work. To use most blood glucose meter, you first insert a test strip into the device. Then you poke a clean fingertip with a special needle to get a drop of blood. You carefully touch the test strip to the blood and wait for a blood glucose reading to appear on the screen. When used and stored properly, blood glucose meters are generally accurate in how they measure the glucose. They differ in the type and number of features they offer. Here are several factors to consider when choosing a blood glucose meter. If you're considered about uh, insurance coverage, check with your insurance provider for coverage details. Some insurance provider limit coverage to specific model or limit the total number of test strips allowed. Cost meters vary in price. Be sure to factor in the cost of test strips. Easy to use in maintenance. Some meters are easier to use than others. Are both the meter and test strips comfortable and easy to hold? Can you easily see the numbers on the screen? How easy is it to get blood onto the strips, how big a drop of blood is required. Now the special features, ask about the features to see what meets your specific need. Special features may include large, easy to handle button and test strips, illuminated screens and audio, which may be useful for people with impaired vision. Information storage and retrieval. Consider how the meter stores and retrieve information so you can track everything you would normally write in a log, such as the time and the date of the test, the result, and trends over time. Some meter offer the ability to share your reading in real time with your doctor with a smartphone app. Or some may offer the option to download your blood glucose reading to a computer or cell phone, then email the test result to your doctor support. Many meter manufacturers include a toll-free number that you can call for help. Look for a meter that includes clear instruction that demonstrate the correct way to use a meter. Some manufacturers offer user manual on their website, advances in monitoring tools, Although finger poke remain the gold standard for blood sugar monitoring, researchers are developing product designed to take the pain out of the process. Now ask your doctor about these alternatives. So now device how it work and what would be the considerations. Alternative site monitor allow blood sample to be taken from areas likely to be less painful than your finger, such as your arm, the palm of your hand or your thigh not as accurate as fingertip sample when blood sugar level is rising or falling quickly they, if you talk about continuous glucose testing uses a sensor placed under the skin to measure blood sugar level transmit each reading to a small recording device worn on your body a smartphone or a smartwatch an alarm can be set to alert of blood sugar level that are too low or too high expensive require sensor to be replaced every 7 to 14 days depending on the brand may need to check blood sugar level with a traditional monitor to confirm reading and to program the device if you have looked at the cost features and other consideration and are still unsure which blood glucose meter to buy ask your doctor or diabetes educator for a recommendation so that's all about the glucose meter the blood glucose meter in this video and one more thing i personally present uh, 
prepare a small presentation for all of you guys in order to reduce your uh, sugar your blood glucose your diabetes so please uh, that will be going to share in the description box below you can check it out from there so before signing off i would like to request you all please do like share subscribe this video with your loved ones so that they can also gain their knowledge about this so that's all we'll definitely meet in the next video till then god bless you bye bye take care